Hey Foxy Stars, you got Foxy and I'm back. Well, let's talk with Foxy Stars. How's everyone doing today? I hope everyone had a wonderful holiday. Um, I did. It was great spending time with family and your loved ones. So today, let's talk. Let's talk. Where did you make your mark significant somewhere in our lifetime? Is your routine an ordinary routine? Or do you have bigger plans for a big assignment? So, Foxy Star, let's talk about that. What mark did you make to make to make your life significance in this world? What did you do that is so significant that you stand out? I'll talk about myself. You know, because I like talking about myself, you know. I like talking about me. But what makes me stand out is because I am who I am. I have always been this way. I've always tried to be like a positive person. Don't get it don't get it twisted. If you get if you make me mad, I'm done with you. It's like I I'm not the type of person like, oh, I'll forgive you, but I will not deal with you no more. That's one thing I mean. I have always been consistent with who I am and I always know who I was. Um when I was younger, I did try to fit in a lot. And I'm like, you know what? But when I got a little bit older, I was like, uh, I don't have to fit in. I'm just going to be me. I was always different. I looked different. Um, my um, best friends was always real light-skinned to me. I always had, you know, the my hair wasn't, it's the texture it is now. The curly, the curly curls. You know, but except that I, I, I wear short and now it was always long. But, you know, it don't matter to me. It's just, it is what it is. And just, I embrace all my naturalness. Um, I always wore glasses. But I always made a significant point in every, in life. I, I knew who I was. So, if I decided, do you know who you are? Did you always know who you was going to be? I always knew who I was going to be. Did I know I was going to be on here, you know, talking to you guys all the time on YouTube? No. No, I didn't. No, <laughs> didn't. But I find that it's therapeutic. It's fun. I have a lot of fun being up here talking to you guys because you get to see me, the real me. And then I'm like, okay, so I was laughing at myself. That that's oh, I'm gonna go live one day and I'm gonna put up that avatar. And I was like, my crazy boy probably wouldn't know how to do that. So, but I am gonna do that one day. I think I'm gonna go live with Let's Talk with Foxy because I don't know. We just might be fun and. I just want everybody to bloom. Let's bloom. Can we just bloom in this world? It's too much. Like I always say, it's just craziness. Like today, you know, it makes you always wonder, you know, the choice that you make in life. Do you learn from them? Is it good that you learn from your mistakes? Absolutely. I think mistakes are wonderful. Mistakes is how you learn and, learn and grow. And a lot of people are like, oh, I don't want to make a mistake. But if you don't make a mistake, how are you going to learn and grow from that mistake? But the, but the problem is, if you do the same mistake and you don't learn from it the first time, then, then we got a problem with that. So, no, we don't do that. So, we want to learn from our mistakes. So, we just want to bloom. We want to grow. We want to be significant. Make ourself known. <laughs> yeah, no, I just got off work, so I just had to pop over here and talk to you guys. I don't mean, I don't know, but talk about. I just like talking to you guys. So, what, what you want to talk about? This, if we can talk about anything. Um, that was my question. There, what makes you significant to others and to yourself? What makes you significant? You know, so, let's see. Um, I hope everybody had a wonderful day with the holiday. I know some people didn't work today. I did. It was okay. You know, it was really slow today at work. So, I was fine. I got a lot of, I actually got a lot of stuff done, you know, without people knocking on my door. But like, hey, I need a, I need a question to this answer or an answer to this question. Or can you, will you, should or could you, could you help me out? I ain't getting on that today. So, that was cool. And so, I get to get home and talk to you guys. So, yeah, I'm going to, you know, if I get off of here, I got me a book I'm going to read. And sometimes it's just being laid back, just being chill. I'm going to chill out in a little bit. I'm going to start this book I found. 
and see how interesting this book is you know um yeah that's all i got for you guys i just wanted to come on and pop on and ask you that question what makes you significant to others and to yourself and also how can you stay in tune with yourself and with others mm. Food for thought, huh, Foxy Stars? Yeah. Then I was going to come and be that deep with you guys today, did you? Nope. So, don't worry about my wall behind me. I need to redo my wall. Because I realized that when I was talking to you guys other day, and I looked at the video, I'm like, I kind of stopped halfway. <laughs> so, I need to go down the further wall. But I'm thinking about, you know, the little parts is not. I think I'm going to put some more flowers and spray paint it in. I think I want the logo to go this way. I don't even know. I'm just, I don't know. But I'm cool with it. So, Foxy Stars, that is all I have for you guys today. I'm just popping in quick and want you to answer that question for me. What makes you significant to others? And importantly, what makes you significant to yourself? Self-care, self-love. Love yourself first. All right, Foxy Stars. As always, from my family to your family, have a wonderful, wonderful night. May you go to sleep tonight and dream of all rainbows and unicorns. As you know my motto, think positive, be positive, strong. It's the new pretty. I just love, y'all going to see this cup so much. I just love this cup. Isn't that beautiful? And like everybody know, I, hey, Tinkerbell is real. Okay, with that being said, you guys have a wonderful, wonderful night. And I will be back. Maybe I'll be back tomorrow. Maybe next day. I don't know. It all depends on how I feel. Because I always love to talk with my foxy stars. A A A A A. It's going to be a party over here. All right, guys. So, let's. Where I'm going? Hmm, I ain't going. Let's go. Could jam jam song. Pop me some popcorn and read my book. So everyone have a wonderful night, and I will be back and talk to you guys soon. So remember that question: What makes you significant to others, and importantly, what makes you significant to yourself? All right, guys. I love you guys. Bye.